was picked up on the routine eye exam. We thought maybe he needed new glasses because he said his glasses weren't working like they should. But instead, doctors told Noel and Tim Wilson their teenage son had a brain tumor. I was devastating. Freaked me out, but I knew that everything was going to be okay. Evan had surgery to remove most of the tumor and then spent his summer undergoing cancer treatment. It was exhausting. <laughs> She's like going in every morning and getting radiation. His mom is an oncology nurse at St. Alphonsus, so she knows how long the road is ahead of them. He just plugs through it one day at a time and thinks it's no big deal. During those long days in treatment, Evan started watching TV shows about the tiny house craze. I just thought it would be really cool to have a place like out back that I could have friends over and stuff, and I could be loud out there and not have parents yelling at me. <laughs> Mom shared that dream with her co-workers at St. Al's. She wanted to surprise Evan at Christmas, and she had no idea what they would do next. We just wanted to band together and help them in any small, tangible way that we could. And then Esther, one of my co-workers, approached Tough Sheds and asked about a shed for Ev because he'd been dreaming about one for a while, and they jumped on it. There was no hesitation. Tough Shed moved quickly, donating a shed, even contacting Home Depot to help deck it out inside. I call up and I say, do you guys have any money left for the end of the year? And they said, we'll give you whatever you want. Any time that we have the opportunity to jump out and help, we do. Right before Christmas, these volunteers showed up to build Evan's tiny shed in the Wilson's backyard. The weather was horrible and they still made it happen anyway. It made us all feel good. We had about 15 employees here that day. And this is all Home Depot paneling, Home Depot allure flooring. The shed was built in a matter of hours. What? What is it? On Christmas, the Wilsons surprised Evan with the tiny house of his dreams. It was awesome. I just, I didn't expect it. I just walked out back and saw it. They just wanted to give our kid a good Christmas. And they did. And they did. Awesome. It means a lot that they took the time out of their day and stuff just to make that for me. It's just heartwarming. It is, you know, especially today when you turn on the news and you hear so, mu so much negativity. You know, we sometimes forget that there's so much goodness in the world and in our own community. To all the people who made Evan's place a reality. Just thank you so much. It's amazing. You are Seven's Heroes.